guys welcome back to my channel today I'm trying out the ball pen challenge so I took my sketchbook and very cheap pens and started drawing I did do the sketch in pencil first because I don't feel comfortable enough to go in use the pen without any pencil sketch underneath I am known for erasing a lot so I was really worried that this would turn into a disaster if I use the pen on a blank paper. Now let's move on to the theme of this drawing. Uh, at first I had something else in mind and it turned into something completely different. At first I imagined a woman in a pool and she was leaning on the edge of the pool and was looking at the camera. And I didn't like that and I changed her pose then the hand was kind of touching her face but I didn't like that either I don't know not, nothing fitted so I erased it again and then the little girl came that you can see me draw right now the little girl uh, who's leaning on a table so yeah, those are very common things every artist uh, struggles with from time to time. So anyway, today's theme is a little girl. I imagined her age around 13-14 and she's from France and she's sitting in one of those gorgeous French cafes drinking something. Well, I haven't really figured out what she's drinking, but it's a drink with... Um, with a little cherry on top and it's a it's a cold drink so the pens I used for this come in two different colors I have a blue that I used for her skin and I have another one in black that I used for everything else after erasing everything for the 100th time I went in to finalize the sketch I added all the details around her eyes polished her lashes, finished her eyebrows and her hair. I also put some more details around her. I only had the table at first, but now you can see picture frames and flowers in the background as well as the back of the chair that I decided would fit great. It's not that I did not have a chair at first, it's just that I imagined one of those backless chairs but since nobody can see where she's sitting, I had to create something that makes it clear that she's sitting. So the pens that I use are a bit thick, so I could not create very thin and crisp lines. Also, when I draw, let's say, a straight line, the ink gets gunked up. And when I pick up the pen to draw some other part, all that gunked up ink spills on my art. You can, of course, wipe it off, but who remembers that every time? One other thing I really don't like um, is that the ink is not black enough for my taste and it's shiny. It's not that matte black ink, if you know what I mean. So I do prefer my Tachikawa pen over these and I would go with that one. But if I have good pens, not necessarily more expensive, just better. I could get very nice results with those. Overall, this was a fun challenge and I do like the results of this piece. Alright, so that was it for this week's video. If you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up, leave a comment down below if you have any questions or just to say hello. Don't forget to subscribe and also if you want to get notified for my upcoming videos, hit that little bell and I will see you next week with another video. Bye guys!